Well, praise the Lord most high, blessed be he. Father, we ask in faith that uh, this stirs uh, the hearts of many to come to you while there is still time. Before the great and terrible day of, uh, of your wrath, in Jesus' name. So uh, <clears throat> today we're going to talk about the, the second sun and the, and the planets uh, which encircle it. So the dwarf uh, sun and uh, the seven planets which uh, orbit uh, around it, uh, well, around the dwarf sun uh, is also the dragon, uh, uh, looking like a looking. He looks like a dragon, which uh, which I will show you as uh, also. Uh, <clears throat> there are a few uh, videos in uh, in here uh, to awaken you, and hopefully uh, you will get. Uh, it will get you to call on the on the name of the Lord, and be saved. Uh, for now is the accepted time. So here is uh, here is the the dwarf sun uh, and uh, two of the seven planets which uh, encircle it. Uh, for for it uh, it is a whole solar system. It's not just the sun and a couple planets or a moon or so. But it says uh, and there are moons, and uh, with it, the dwarf sun is what uh, many call uh, an iron ball, uh, which is a very he heavy uh, magnetic core. Uh, they, they think it might be a, an iron ball, period. And, uh, but it's got a, a, a debris field uh, that's unbelievable and, and stretches back uh, uh, millions of miles, possibly millions of miles, which will flip our. Uh, Planet as uh, as it flies by, uh, along with the, the fireballs, uh, which are named uh, in Revelations, and those will be like uh, about 70, 70 pounds, just as it did uh, in the times of the flood of Noah, saving uh, only Noah and his family. Now, you've bound to have seen where we have flooding everywhere. I mean, uh, snow. I mean, this. It's uh, it, the the world is uh, the whole world is uh, topsy turvy right now, and it's getting worse. Uh, you can see also uh, our sun is no longer yellow, uh, but blazing white hot. It is uh, it is the reason for uh, for all the record uh, heat and. Uh, and you can surely see all the all the changes which are who are taking place all around the world, uh, with record flooding uh, everywhere in the in the world. And it's not just record flooding; it's earthquakes and everything else. So, uh, with snow falling in in tropical areas never before seen. So here you are. Here's the here's the videos. Welcome back to Forbidden Knowledge News. Today is Saturday, April 28th, 2018. Days of Noah, as catastrophic flooding and torrential hail continues in the Middle East and Africa. Storms from the 25th through the 27th caused record-breaking flooding and killed nearly a hundred people. In Syria, Saudi Arabia Jordan Israel Jerusalem Iran and Algeria
On the 27th, a torrential rain bomb caused severe flooding in San Miguelito, Panama. Heavy rain and destructive hail hit Buenos Aires, Argentina on the 27th, causing damage to vehicles and homes. Also on the 27th, an anomalous storm brought hurricane force winds to Honduras. Also on the 27th, residents forced to evacuate after 10 sinkholes open in Ocala, Florida. Engineers have surveyed the area, but have yet to find the cause. According to a new study, wave-driven flooding from rising seas will leave many Pacific islands uninhabitable before mid-century. This annual flooding will result in the islands becoming uninhabitable because of frequent damage to infrastructure and the inability of their freshwater aquifers to recover between overwash events. The study suggests that many of these Pacific Atoll islands will be rendered uninhabitable by 2030. Don't forget to subscribe and like our Facebook page. Happened uh, around 9 a.m. as I found a uh, as I found a place to pull over and take some pictures. Now, I took several pictures, but I took these pictures, uh, and and here they are. Uh, the first one uh, I had thought uh, I, I had thought I had gotten both sons in, into the middle uh, of the picture, which would have been ideal. Uh, but the glare was so bad uh, from the sun, they bright that uh, I just pointed the camera, and uh, it is in the first picture. Both sons are in the picture, but it's uh, on the far left side, and you can see where the chemtrail also is. And you can see the edge of the sun. And then the second picture I I took of the second sun where the end showed you the chemtrail that's falling. And uh, boy, those guys must be good pilots because it's uh, they, it's amazing how they uh, can cover that. It was not uh, it was not the case, however. You uh, you can see the second sun in, in the in the in the first shot, just not as good as I would have liked.
now that you have seen uh, some of these uh, planets and, and the dwarf sun, uh, that uh, that they have uh, uh, circled around uh, this smaller their smaller sun, which is the dwarf sun. Understand that uh, this also is the is the cause of, of the great flood of Noah's time, and again it is it is here uh, to bring in the wrath of the Lamb. And that was the wrath of of God also, but then flows Noah's flood because it, it took care of uh, all Earth, uh, you know, all the breathing, air breathing uh, creatures, everything that were on the face of the earth. These planets and uh, and the dwarf sun are already in our solar system. In fact, they're very close, and uh, at any time they can uh, start the wrath of, of the Lamb. Who uh, who came and died uh, on the cross, giving uh, giving our only chance of, at redemption. This is the Lamb who was slain uh, from the foundation of the earth. In Revelation 5:12, saying uh, with a loud voice, "Worthy is the Lamb that was slain, uh, and to receive power and riches and and wisdom and strength, and honor and glory and and blessing." In Revelation 13:8, and it uh, and all that dwell upon the earth shall worship him whose name uh, whose names are not written in the book uh, of life of the Lamb slain from the from the foundation of the world. Now you will be sitting with them, and that's what that's talking about. So uh, uh, whose names are not written in the book of life? Now these people they're not in the book of life. Those that were, are born again, born of water and of spirit, and truly love the Lord are those that are written. And those are, are the ones that are sitting with him on his throne. Those who have their names written in the book of life are, are sitting with him on his throne. Uh, you can still you can still be one of them if you come now. For they were, uh, for they were born again, as uh, as Jesus said, uh, for for us to do uh, to enter into the kingdom. In John three five, uh, Jesus uh, said, answered, verily, verily, I say unto you, except a man be born of water and of spirit, he cannot enter into the kingdom of God. Those who are uh, those who are of earth uh, never received the the spirit. Uh, to make them uh, sons of God, uh, because they only were baptized, or maybe none at all, that they didn't receive the Spirit. Uh, yet, even yet, every knee in heaven and on earth uh, shall bow their knee to the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords, Jesus Christ. Right now, uh, only 20% of uh, of those in the churches. Will will make the rapture and uh, be spared the wrath of the Lamb. You can uh, you can make this uh, uh, number go up uh, with you in it, uh, being uh, being counted worthy to enter the kingdom and sit at the right hand of the Father. Uh, but uh, but you must stir yourself and seek uh, seek the Lord now while there while there is yet a little time, and I mean little time. Uh, for you to do so. In 2 Corinthians 6 2, for, for he saith, I have heard you in a time accepted, and in the day of salvation have I, t I have secured you. Behold, now is the accepted time. Behold, now is the day of salvation. You are, uh, you are being called now. Uh, will you come? Well, uh, I sure hope so, <laughs> for your sake. So, uh, just remember, uh, and well, let's pray. Uh, let, let us pray, because I don't want to miss an opportunity to, uh, if anyone has a need, or if they want to rededicate yourself to the Lord, now's the time to call on the name of the Lord. And Father, we come to you now, Lord, for every soul, for every heart. Oh God, tenderize their heart, oh God, that they understand the importance of calling on you now or before the great and terrible day of the Lamb. Father, 
la kupaske ko ki kana madro kasha na katana la ko re kala kala ko mara ki te te mora re ko da la hata da ta ta mo ko la kati shike ko ko skat kat ko re te te ki kanda la ka la ko te te ma hari ke te na ba re ya ke ta ti na in jesus now remember as always jesus loves you and i love you now you be blessed until next time in jesus holy name bless people